Impressionism still is one of the most loved art histories in the world. It's got a great joyousness, a great celebration of life, of colour, of innovation, of hope and the future. This exhibition is going to delight people because it's going to reintroduce them to works that they've actually grown up with, whether it's looking at Renoir, looking at Monet, whether it's the Cezannes. But the beautiful thing about an exhibition of this depth and quality is that you're also going to see other examples by those artists and be introduced to other artists that you may not be so familiar with. This is one of the MFA's signature collections, what visitors around the world associate with the institution. Part of the enduring appeal of Impressionist paintings more than 100 years on from when they were painted is that these are artists and artworks that champion the everyday, immediate surroundings and modern life. It's hard to describe the experience of seeing all these works together, of being in person with so many magnificent works of art. It can be really energizing. The luminous color palettes, the rich fairy brushstrokes provide so much to see and to think about. This exhibition represents a really unique opportunity. It's over 100 works, but of those, 79 have never been to Australia before. The exhibition features a room of 16 wonderful canvases by Monet, which is a fantastic exploration of the places where Monet lived and experienced and painted over and over again. When you see his paintings en masse, you see the consistency of his approach to nature. As a viewer, it helps you think about that moment of encounter with an artwork, of experiencing something of such visual beauty. This exhibition tells the great story of where Impressionism came from, as well as giving us a remarkable kaleidoscopic vision of the full trajectory of the Impressionist movement itself. We hear little quotes from each of the artists in the exhibition that reminds us they were real people. They were friends, sometimes they were frenemies, they were in competition with each other as much as in collaboration. The vibrancy of the palette, the texture of the paint, the movement of the artist's hand, it's all here and it's incredibly emotive and evocative and something that just transforms you. Spend as much time as you can with each work and uh, I guarantee you, you'll feel a lot better at the end of it.